likes colouring in. Oh, everybody, who likes colouring in on paper? Put your hand in the air if you like colouring in on paper. Put your hand in the air if you like colouring in in colouring in books. Who likes colouring in in colouring in books? Oh, brilliant. Put your hands in the air if you like colouring in on your grandparents' living room walls. <gasps> you shouldn't do that. That's very not. Oh my gosh, you shouldn't do that. Who likes colouring in their dad's face? Put your hand in the air if you like that. Oh my gosh, poor dads. Everybody put their hand up there. That's terrible. Well, look. I'm going to teach you how to do magic colouring. Now, to do magic colouring, there's two things that you need, and the first thing that you need is something to colour in. I have over here a picture, and we're going to colour in this picture. It's a black and white picture, but it's a picture of my dad. Now, my dad was the greatest magician in the world. He taught me how to do magic, and this is a picture of my dad. I will show it you, but I don't want to see anyone laughing at the picture of my dad. Remember, I can see all of you. No laughing, no sniggering, no giggling, no chuckling, no laughing, no laughing, no sniggering, no giggling, and no laughing. This is my dad. That's my dad right there. That's my dad. I see you laughing. Stop laughing. I see you all laughing. Yes, my dad was a clown but he was a magic clown and he taught me how to do magic. So we're gonna color in this picture of my dad. Now, the other thing that you need is a good imagination. You're gonna be really good at pretending. Put your hand in the air if you're good at pretending. Who's good at pretending? Oh, brilliant. Well, let's see how good you are at pretending. I want you to imagine there's millions of invisible colors in the air and they're all over your clothes as well. And when I say go, we're gonna grab all the invisible colors. So put your hands up like this. Get ready to grab the invisible colors. Everyone put your hands up. And on three, we're gonna grab all the invisible colors. One, two, three, go. Take the reds, the yellows, the pinks, the greens, the oranges, the purples, the blue. Take all the colors, take them all, take them all. Hold them tightly, don't let them go. Take those colors and put them in your mouth. Now chew them up like this, go. And swallow. And then rub them around in your belly. Lovely. You guys are awesome. Now, all you've got to do to colour in the picture of my dad, you've just got to blow the colours back at the picture. But I don't want a little blow like this. That's not very good at all. I don't want a normal blow like this. That's not good either. I want a big blow. Let me show you how to do a big blow. You take a deep breath. Hold it. And you go right at the screen. And if you blow hard enough, we will colour in this picture of my dad. So let's see if we can do it. Let's have a practice, first of all. Everyone take a deep breath. Take a deep breath, hold it, and blow. Oh, that's very good. Now, if you do that, you'll definitely color in the picture of my dad. So I'm gonna come really close. Here we go, Ted, get ready. Take a deep breath like this. <gasps> Take a deep breath, hold it. And on three, you're gonna blow. One, two, three, blow. blow, 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 blow. That is brilliant. And guys, this picture now looks absolutely Rubbish, it's rubbish. I didn't color in, stop laughing. I can see you all laughing, it's not funny. Look, I know what the problem is, there's two problems. The main problem is you didn't blow big enough, but there is another problem. Normally when I do this trick, I have, two, I have a person or two people on stage with me and they come up and they help me and I let them hold my magic wand and they wave the magic wand around. Now the problem is you're all the way over there and I'm all the way over here. I can't pass my magic wand to you. You can't climb through your TV and come and join me. But I have an idea. You may not realise this, but when it's somebody's birthday, they have more magic inside them than any other day of the year. Which means that Max and Toby, because it's their birthday party, they aren't just the most magical people at this party. And Max and Toby are the most magical people in the whole wide world. Which means Max and Toby can get this working for us and only Max and Toby can make this work. So Max, Toby, give me thumbs up so you know I'm talking to you. Give me thumbs up, very good. Now here's what I want you to do, guys, as quickly as you can. With super duper mega speed, I want you to rush off, get a TV remote control each, and then bring it back and hold it in front of the screen so I can see your TV remote controls. Quickly as you can, go, 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 go. Go get your TV remote controls, and when you've got them, hold them right up to the screen so I can see them. Because those TV remote controls are gonna be magic wands. And because, you have birthday magic inside you. Those TV remote controls are going to be the most magical magic wands in the world. So what's going to happen, Max and Toby? You guys are going to wave your TV remote controls. We don't even need this. Go on. You're going to wave your TV remote controls around. All of your friends are going to blow as hard as they can. If they blow hard enough, if you wave fast enough, 
this picture of my dad will color in. Let's see if we can make it happen. Guys, if you are ready, give me two thumbs up. Let me know everyone who's ready, who's ready. Everybody's ready, brilliant. I'm gonna come really close to the screen. Everybody take a deep breath. Big deep breath, hold it on three, blow. Max, Toby, get ready to wave. One, two, three, blow! Wave it, Max, wave it, Toby! Wave faster, blow harder! Oh, that's amazing, guys. You're not gonna believe this, but this picture now looks terrible. Guys, I'm so sorry. I see Max and Toby laughing, look, I'm really sorry. I really wanted to make it color in. And honestly, if it had have colored in, it would have been so good. We would have given Max and Toby a bit. Why is everyone pointing at the screen? What's the matter? You're all doing this and pointing. What, why are you? You're trying to tell me it's colored in. I know it didn't color in. I'm really sorry, guys. I'm so sorry. If it had have colored in, it would have, but why are you pointing at the screen? Look, it's rude to point. I'm sorry it didn't work. Sometimes magic doesn't work, and I'm really sorry about that. But if it had have worked, stop pointing. I know it didn't work. Look, I'm really sorry about that. If it had have worked, it would have been so good. Everybody would have, look, stop pointing. I, ah! Oh my gosh. Look at that. Oh, wow, you guys did it. Everybody give Max and Toby a big, massive round of applause. They are amazing. You did it. Oh, that's brilliant. I'll tell you what, if you're having a good time, put your hand in the air. If you're having a good time, wave your hand around. And if you're having a good time, say, me! Brilliant. I'm going to show you another trick right now. Now, this trick is amazing. This trick is all about films. Who likes watching films? Put your hand in the air if you like watching films. I love watching films. Now, you guys might have seen my favorite film. If you've seen my favorite film, let's put your hand in the air so I know you've seen it. My favorite film is Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. Who's seen Charlie and the Chocolate Factory? Isn't that a great film? Now, there's a bit in the film where Willy Wonka, that's the man that owns the Chocolate Factory, takes a big, massive chocolate bar, puts it into a machine, presses a button, pulls a lever, the chocolate bar disappears flies up in the air in a million pieces, flies across the room invisibly in a million pieces, lands inside the TV, and then Charlie reaches into the TV, takes the chocolate bar out, and eats it. Who remembers that bit of the film? Put your hand in the air if you do. Who remembers that bit of the film? Oh, you do, brilliant. Who here would like me to do that trick live at Max and Toby's fifth birthday party? If you would, put your hand in the air. Oh, you all would. Oh, brilliant. Okay, now I haven't got a TV, but it doesn't matter because I can improvise. Instead of a TV, I've got something just as good. Let me grab it for you. Instead of a TV, I have these two. Oh, let me grab them. There we go, I've got two blue hankies. Now who can see the blue hankies? Put your hand in the air if you can see the blue hankies. Good, now these two blue hankies, I'm gonna tie them together. And these are gonna be our TV. Uh, I'm good at tying knots because I used to be a scout. So here we go. There we go, double knotting. I'm gonna tie double knot in these two blue hankies, tying them together. This is gonna be our TV. And then we're gonna take another hanky, a red one, that'll be our chocolate bar. We'll make the red hanky disappear and it'll appear tied in between the two blue hankies. And that'll be like the chocolate bar going into the TV. But I cannot do this on my own. I'll need help. Put your hand in the air if you're okay to help me. Who, who wants to help me? Put your hand in the air if you do. Oh, brilliant. Okay, everybody. So here's what I need you to do. First of all, watch these two blue hankies really carefully. I'm going to put them down my top so you can see them the whole time. Now, we need a different colored hanky. That's where this red one comes in. There we go. So I've got this red one. Put your hand in the air if you can see the red hanky. Who can see the red hanky? Brilliant. Now, this is the idea. We're going to make this disappear. So to make it disappear, I'm going to put it in my hand so you guys can't see it. If you can see it, it's not going to work. So I'm going to put it all the way into my hand and I'm not going to leave any bits sticking out the top because if there's any bits sticking out the top, then you won't, it won't work. So I need to put all of these little bits in like this. There we go. Now you can't see it. I can start making this hanky disappear. And why are you pointing again? What? Oh, sorry. It fell out the bottom. I'm sorry. That shouldn't happen. I've got, I've got little hands. Let me try that again. Here we go. Put it all the way in. I'm not going to leave any bits sticking out now. Look. Non sticking out this side, non sticking out this side. Now I want you to watch really carefully because we're going to make this hanky. Why are you pointing again? Stop pointing. It's rude to. Fine. Sorry. <laughs> that was my fault. Let me try that one more time. Here we go. Put it all the way in the hand. Right. Now to make this disappear, don't leave any sticking out. There we go. Ugh, weird. To make this disappear, you guys 
have to learn the magic. Now, let me show you what the magic is. Guys, when I say wiggle it, let's have a practice. When I say wiggle your fingers, stick your fingers out and wiggle them as fast as you can. All 10 fingers, wiggle them. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Very good. Now, when I say wiggle your toes, stick out your toes and wiggle your toes as fast as you can. Very good. Now, when I say wiggle your ears, reach up and wiggle your ears as fast as you can. And finally, when I say wiggle your nose, go ahead and wiggle your nose. And the magic words at the end are hocus pocus. If we put all this together, we can make this red hanky disappear. So if you're ready, put your hand in the air. I'm not gonna start until everyone's hand is in the air. Who's ready? Max, Toby, are you ready? Are they ready? I think they're ready, brilliant. Right, here we go, let's do this, here we go. Everybody, wiggle your fingers, wiggle your toes, wiggle your ears, wiggle your nose. Everybody shout, hocus pocus. Oh, good job, guys. Now, this handkerchief has now disappeared. Now, here's the thing. I, well, it's invisible. I'll be able to see it because I'm a magician. You guys won't be able to see it because you're not magicians. I'm a magician, so I can see it. To you, it's going to look like I'm holding nothing. To me, I can see the red hanky. Now, you can't see the red hanky because you're not magicians. I can see... What, why is everyone pointed again? What, hang on. Can you see this red hanky? Give me a thumbs up if you can see this red hanky. <gasps> I did not realize that Max and Toby's friends were so, 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 so super magical. Right, okay, we're gonna have to try something else. You're gonna have to wiggle 20 times faster. And the other thing is, Max, Toby, have you still got those TV remote controls? We're gonna need them again. Have you still got them? Hold them up high like a magic wand. Let's see if we can do this. Max, Toby, you're gonna have to wave the TV remote controls and your friends are gonna have to wiggle faster than anything they've wiggled before and hopefully we can make it work. Let's do this. I'll put it in my hand, right? Everybody, wiggle your fingers! Wave them, Max and Toby. Wiggle your toes, wiggle your ears, wiggle your nose, wiggle your legs, wiggle your hair, wiggle your head, wiggle your chest, wiggle your teeth, wiggle your shoulders, wiggle your elbows, wiggle your knees, wiggle your bum, wiggle everything all at the same time, shout, hocus, pocus! Brilliant, oh my gosh, you guys are so good. It's definitely worked now. Who would like to see that it's invisible? Put your hand in the air if you would. Who'd like to see, right, okay, I'll show you, look, here it is. There it is, it's invisible right now. Why are you shaking your heads? Oh, you want me to open up my hand? No problem. There you go. You see, there's nothing in my hand. There you go. It's gone. It's completely. Why are you pointing that way? Oh, I get sorry. No, I'm not cheating. Let me just show you this hand. Hang on. <clears throat> see, it's not there. It's completely disappeared. Thank you very much. It's what what you're pointing that way now. Why are you look? I can't believe you guys think I'm cheating. Look, there's nothing there. Okay, it's gone. It's completely stop pointing. It's not there either, okay? It's gone, it's vanished. Oh, you want me to open up both hands at the same time, like this. See, I told you it's disappeared. It's traveling invisibly, and it's gonna land right here, tied in between the two blue hankies. Now, here's how it's gonna work. On the count of three, I'm gonna pull as hard as I can. Max and Toby, one last time, are going to wave their TV remote controls around as fast as they can. And you guys are going to shout hocus pocus. Now, if you shout loud enough, if I pull hard enough, and if they wave their magic wands fast enough, then hopefully the red hanky will be tied in between the two blue hankies. Let's see if we can make this happen. Guys, on three, hocus pocus as loud as you can. One, two, three, wave it, Max and Toby. Everybody shout, Pocus! Pocus! Give it a pull. Oh my gosh, look at that. We did it. It is there, tied in between the two blue hankies. You guys did it. You were amazing. Give yourselves a big, massive round of applause. Give yourselves a big clap. Give yourselves a big, massive, 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 massive clap. You guys are so good. I tell you what, who's having a good time? Put your hand in the air if you're having a good time. Wave it around like this so I know you're having a good time. We're going to do one last trick, and then we're going to start the party games. And this last trick is my favorite trick. Now, who here, ha who here likes puppets? Put your hand in the air if you like puppets. Who likes puppets? I have the best puppet ever. The reason he's the best puppet ever is because... He's magic. He's not just a normal puppet. He's a magic puppet and he's a dog. His name is Charlie. 
and he's a magical puppet dog and he is my best friend. Put your hand in the air if you've got a best friend. Who's got a best friend? I have a best friend. Charlie is my best friend. We go everywhere we're together and we do everything together. Now, who here would like to meet Charlie? Put your hand in the air if you'd like to meet Charlie. You would. Now, the problem is Charlie's a bit old now. He's getting on a bit and he sleeps a lot in the day. And I've got him here. <laughs> but he's fast asleep. So we're gonna to have to wake him up. Now it's very easy to wake up a puppet. To wake up a puppet, all you have to do, as loud as you can, you just need to shout, wake up Charlie, just like that. And if you shout loud enough, he'll wake up and then I can bring him out and we can get to meet him because he is awesome. But you're gonna to have to shout really loud. Everybody on three, as loud as you can, everybody shout, wake up Charlie. One, two, three, wake up. Up, Charlie! Come on, Charlie, get up. I'm sorry, he's, he's waking up, Charlie. Come on, Charlie, everybody here is here to see you. Guys, here it is. This is Charlie. Everybody wave and say hello, Charlie. Look, Dad, Charlie, all of these kids are here to see you. Yeah. Oh, Charlie says hello, everyone. Do you want to give Charlie, everyone give Charlie a wave? Everyone give Charlie a wave. There you go. See those over there, Charlie? That's Max and Toby. Oh, Max, Toby, Charlie says hello. There you go, you're having fun, yeah. Now, Charlie and I, we are best friends. Tell them we're best friends. See, he's nodding his head. We are best friends and we do, e Charlie, don't shake your head. Don't be silly. We're best friends. Tell them we're best friends. See, he's nodding his head. Me and Charlie are best friends and we, Charlie, stop it. Look, this is the problem. Charlie is a bit naughty, aren't you? He's a bit naughty and he likes playing tricks on people, but his favorite thing in the world is fetch. He loves fetch. Now, he's got his favorite ball here. This is his favorite ball. He can't take his eyes off it. He watches it everywhere. Now, I throw this ball for him. He then runs off, he catches it, he eats it, he chews it, and we play it over and over again. But Charlie, we have not got time to play fetch. We're at Max and Toby's birthday. We're going to do a trick, okay? So I'm going to put this ball away. Now, guys, let me tell you about the trick that me and Charlie are going to do, because it's such a good trick. Why is everyone pointing? Why, why are you all pointing? What are you pointing at? What? Charlie! Stop it! Charlie, you're trying to make me look silly. Yes, he is. Look, look. This is the problem, Charlie does magic. And sometimes he tries to make me look silly. I'll put it away. Now, where was I saying? Yes, so this is what we're gonna do. We are go will you stop pointing? What you, ah! Charlie, give me the ball. Look, I'm really sorry. If you see this ball go into his mouth, can you let me know? Point at the screen and shout and scream because he's not meant to be doing this. I'm really sorry. Now, here's what's gonna happen, guys. Ch look, the pointing at the screen. Charlie, give me the ball. Just give me the ball. I'm so sorry. I'm so, look, your ears all over the place. I'm really sorry. Let me put it away. Now, did, Charlie, I saw that. Will you stop playing about? Look, guys, I am, he's not meant to be doing this. I'm going to put it away. Look, look, watch, 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 watch. There it goes. Now, there is no way that that ball can go back into that dog's mouth. There is no way. It's impossible because the ball is in my, you saw me put the ball in my pocket. It can't be in his bag. Charlie, stop it. Last time, it's in my pocket. Now, there is no way it can get in his mouth. It is impossible. They're pointing, Charlie, is in your mouth. He says it's not in his mouth. Okay, so this is what we're gonna do. The trick that we're, they're still pointing. If I let you do your magic trick to all the boys and girls, will you behave? Yeah, guys, just so you know, just so he knows you wanna see his trick, put your hand in the air if you wanna see it. See, look, Charlie, they've all put the hand up, okay? They all want to see the trick. So you're going to behave now, yeah? Good. Now, Charlie's trick uses this. This is a magic pot. Now, inside the pot, there are handkerchiefs, as you can see. There's three of them because it's called the three hanky trick. Now, the first one is this one here. This is blue. I want you, Charlie, to hold on to the blue handkerchief tightly. Now, guys, I want you to watch that blue handkerchief and do not blink. You're going to hold it tightly, Charlie. Are you sure, Charlie? Yes. Now, do not let you, anything, don't let, keep your eyes on Charlie's hanky. You're okay. You're good. Yes. Now, I'm going to tell you what's going to happen with the hanky. We're going to do something absolutely amazing with it because this is going to be the best. They're pointing again, Charlie. Why are they pointing? What they're pointing at? What, what, what they're pointing at? I don't know what the, where's the hanky gone? Where's the hanky gone? Where did you put the hanky? Are you sure? Charlie says all of the boys and girls took the hanky off him. Guys, did you take his, his hanky? Did you take his hanky? They're shaking their head, it doesn't matter. 
It doesn't matter. We've got another one, haven't we, Charlotte? We've got another one. I've got another one over here. I've got this one. This is a red one. Guys, watch the red hanky. You hold on to it tightly. Don't lose it, Charlie. And don't let, look at me, look at me. Don't let anyone else take it, okay? Very good. Now, guys, it can't be the three hanky trick anymore. It's going to have to be the two hanky trick, but it's still a good trick. What's going to happen with the two hanky trick is we're going to take the two, what, what, everyone's pointing again. What's the matter? Why are they pointing? Why are they, Charlie, where did it go this time? Are you sure? He says the moms and dads took it this time. Is that right, guys? Did the moms and dads, did the adults take it? They're shaking their head, Charlie. Look, we've only got one hanky left. And luckily, it's Charlie's favorite color. It's green. Now, Charlie probably won't lose a green hanky. So hold it tightly. Do not lose it. Now, guys, this is what's going to happen. You watch that hanky really, really carefully because we're going to do something absolutely... Ah! Did he eat the hankies, guys? Did he eat the hankies, Charlie? Did you eat the hankies? Why did you do... Stop laughing, Charlie. If you start laughing, they're all going to laugh at you as well. Stop laughing. What do you do that for? He says it's all part of the trick. Really? It's all part of the trick? What do you mean it's all part of the trick? Charlie says he can bring the hankies back. Who'd like him to bring the hankies back? Put your hand in the air if you would. You all want to see the hankies come back. How are we going to do that, Charlie? Okay, he says the hankies are going to come back in the, in the pot. I don't see how they're going to come back in the pot. The pot is empty. There's nothing in the pot. I think he's been a bit silly. But he says they're going to come back in the pot. How is this going to work? Okay. 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 He says, on the count of three, you've all got to say the magic words. What are the magic words? Okay, apparently the magic words are, Charlie is awesome. Is that right? Silly magic words, but you've got to say, Charlie is awesome. And anything else? Okay, Max and Toby, you've got to grab your TV remote controls again. You've got to wave them around. Anything else? No, we're good. So you're going to shout, Charlie is awesome. Max and Toby, you're going to wave the TV remote controls around. And then hopefully we will have the hankies back inside here. So on the count of three, everybody, Charlie is awesome. And at the same time, Max, Toby, wave the TV remote controls. Let's see if we can make this happen. Here we go. One, two, three. Charlie is awesome. That's amazing. I can't believe it's worked. Who wants to see it? Put your hand in the air if you want to see it. You're not going to believe this. This is amazing. The first one came back, the second one came back, the third one came back, and they're all tied together. Everybody give Charlie a big massive round of applause. Everybody give Charlie a big clap. Take a bow, Charlie. Take another bow, Charlie. Take another bow. Take another bow. That's very good. Now look, I've got to get on with the show. So I'll tell you what, you sit over there, and after I finish the show, we'll go for a walk. Okay, good. Right, everybody, everyone say bye, Charlie. There you go, look, they're all waving at you, Charlie. They love you, Charlie. Look at that, isn't that amazing?